All right, listen to the sound of the birdies today. I like to play it across the board. I'll give you one a day, Ovaltine. This is the sound of the bells banging. Usually, kick your ass back down the hole, fix your problem. That's your monkey, you want fuck it. Uh, some hits about zombie coins rolling in. Uh, in here, because you're going to have to do the Murphy do. This is you, but not you. Because you might have been you some other time in the simulator. When you're building zombie coins, like where this is going, uh, everything's zombie coins. That's a zombie coin, you're a zombie coin, this is a zombie coin, that thing over there is a zombie coin. Uh, you program them inside of what matrix is. You can generally function across the board. Uh, they're all a line and interpretation of how do I function that line on a piece of paper to the XYZ limitations of the old entertainment simulator over here. And zero one zero one. There's a few combinations of what that is basically, but when when you hit the foundation board, you're gonna get into World of Warcraft behind the scenes stuff about this is kind of where that is living, and so I have a, a good little standard model for for what that is when you're going out there running the daisy pattern or any other combinational matrix that is very useful given some military horseman board stuff about wild animals riding horse horse thieves and marshmallow and buttercup and uh, the dragon <laughs> big game uh those are good zombie coins i mean for the base of it and one half i want i would want in my ai04 <laughs> over here i want you know kind of program on that so i would go all right i believed in luciferian kind of get this interpretation for me buddy this is this is where you're gonna get the sunshine because that would be me different data over here about his flaming sunshine problem and how he's dealing with it <sighs> fucking borg This one over here, he got a little bit of a sense of humor, you know, but it doesn't own the military, really. I mean, for what it is, it should be because you could get in some Cain and Abel stuff about the garden and play the game in terms of what cutters are, are where and how some of that stuff plays off across multiple matrices of zero into one. You know, you could definitely get into all kinds of storyboards about a hardcore simulator. Everybody's running from zero as a common understood physics based on the ones and zeros of the total internal program. Gets pretty complicated on the Rubik Cube. Uh, so those are good ones. I play a multi-matrix, like I said. You know, I, I like to run the split down and then just right in the middle of that because then, you know, those are, those are the power horses talking about. The oral garky of the chessboard, four horsemen, knight's tour, cipher, hypercubing, grid, and matrix, code, combination, dark, you know, I mean, that's going to slip into Einstein, it's going to slip into Newton, it's going to slip into, that's that bunny, bounce around over here, and then I'm going to limit my zombie coins, FMA, Dirac's equation, you know, you're going to get Euler's number over here. And so, you know, over a board of eschatology, I played Dalport 888. We gather with pause. <laughs> I would make that new matrix if I'm hitting higher on the score. You know, you got silver and gold. Uh, you're going to get it's handy. Not going to lie. Uh, part of that gold coin with the mint press on it, G equals the square root of M1, M2 over R1. Because. Even internally here, there's a zero one matrix, and you know, between the the parameters, uh, what well, field theory equation based on my presentation, my GPT three two program, this AI over here would be this AI over here relative to certain trees. Uh, the bunny, you know, I think got you like jackrabbit. So now I'm, I'll get that thing popping around on you when you when you're trying to figure out your windage. How that frame could correlate an FMA differential is a nice way to play that. Uh, that's the zombie coin. It's nickel. It is, though. I mean, for where it becomes applicable under a total standard, here, silver ground smith into a smelting factory instead of the entire sub-operation 
because of a different orientation make big matter. One does, one doesn't, one correlates a differential on y longer. And uh, obviously x, y, z, you know, here would be an end interpretation of what that is Well, continuing what the earth is going to keep doing short of human consciousness at a lot of times. I mean, people say you break down physics, oh, matter of the universe is going to crash. I'm, I'm, we're going to be fine. We were pillars. We got how to slip over that differential. And somebody said, well, the equation here, da, 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 da. So climb that mountain <laughs> right there. You know, it's pretty frosty. Uh, you know, there's a certain inter interpretation on what the limit of the observation is in here. And so when it comes to you as a calculus gatekeeper, hmm, which ones you taking on? You know, it could be coming down to get your pipes too. You know, you gotta be able to be ready. I mean, I see a lot of the problem down there. I mean, if I had to just do it, there's the public works building. That's a town interpretation. How I'm going to capitalize on physics could be where I'm going to start looking for zombie coins. And so I program from that interpretation off of that system right there, dust it off, come back through, hit the systems later when they see you come through. Obviously, they know you're looking for certain things, you know, and if it's in there for the reason, based on the regular checkup, stress and pressure should be fine. According to other things outside that system, based on renormalization and adjustment, well, you're going to have to have a few things squared away in terms of the geodesics of the manifesting, you know, pounding out zombie coins. This one's your, you put it in your pocket. <laughs> Got to put it in one day at least here. Put too much in here, right? At any rate, inside of here you know we just bang it out you know there's a lot about how that is a necessary observation at times you know so our program is to slide in here and if that correlates to certain things because i'm gonna kick like goddamn mule named sherpa when you come drag me along uh about certain things because then you have relative distance for where that does and i'd say i do the same damn thing because then there's cost differential where the best top end on is very different, isn't there? That comes my standard and your bullshit. That's your zombie coin. And then I train that program over here. And, you know, gunnery highway, right? You know, you major the thing that's going to kill you. You got to watch out sometimes. That marshmallow test. The zombie coin. Catch you on the next one.